All right. You ready? Yep. All right. So this is an explanation of how Phone Buddy and Surfer Buddy work together. Uh, we have two basic functions. One is to transfer pictures automatically from your phone straight into Surfer Buddy. Uh, that function is as follows. We have Surfer Buddy. We navigate to the place where we want to be. So you can see that we're going to click a little icon here. It puts a QR code. We pull up our server buddy, and now we're going to scan the code to connect. Now it's picked up the IP address, which if you want to know what your IP address is, it's right there on your screen as well. And indeed, we are connected. That's our status. Okay, we're going to go back to the part manager, and at this point in time, we would like to send a picture. So what we're going to do is we first have to snap it. So I want a picture of one of these little tiny connectors. I've taken it. I, it's a little blurry, so I'm not going to send that one. I'm going to take another one. That's better. Now I'm going to click OK, and now I'm going to send it. You'll see a little progress bar, and when it's done, it will make a, a beeping sound. And it, the system told us that. Yeah. And now if you come up here, you'll see, indeed, that the image is added. And here is our preview, which was nicely done by Elvana. Thank you, Elvana. Okay, that concludes the first function of Phone Buddy and Surfer Buddy. The next one will be, how do we order parts automatically? So now we're going to go back to Phone Buddy. Got to go back to the home. We might need a home button. And we're going to click the button that says Order Items. Now with Order Items, we're looking for a QR code, and now we've picked up the part number, and I would like to order 55. Oh no, this adds the number one, so you see I just increment, so if I want 25, 35, 45, add 50, now I got 95, 5 more makes 100, or I could have just done clear and added 100 like that, and now I'm going to order those. 50 pieces already on order list. Press undo to remove last order. There you go. And I push the order, and now it's added. Okay, so now I'm going to come to another part. And to do that, this should have gone after ordering back to the order screen, but it didn't do that. So let's get right back where we were. Sorry about that. Uh, oh, phone buddy. I'm still learning how to use this thing. Order items. Well, it should have triggered. There. You have to be at the right thing. So let's order 30 of those. Order. Pieces already on order list. Press undo to remove Excellent. Order. All right, we're done. That's all we wanted to show. And, oh, well, I will show them that they, oh, it would end here just so they can see. If we go to grid views, you will see that we just added uh, 30 more pieces. So there should be 130 on order, and indeed they are right there. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. If you could post that to give her.